me a little worried it is going to tip over and break my iPod, but I don't know. So, uh, yes, it is December, so really, really close to Christmas or uh, Hanukkah or whatever you celebrate. Um, so I thought that I should just do um, a Christmas special. Like, well, not just like, oh no, it's just one video Christmas special, that sucks. No, I mean like a whole series throughout the, um, uh, throughout December. So, but when the 25th, or 20, I still got a slide, 25th comes, these videos will be ending. I'm just kidding. Um, I mean, like, I'll do my favorite guns when, well, when the, that, <sighs> wait, maybe I can end it. At the, I still haven't worked this out. So it's a Christmas special. Um, I'm doing Nerf gun reviews. So basically, just take a Nerf gun and then from my arsenal and then review it. And then plus, um, it's also it's this is this the December version. I'm gonna also do like uh, maybe. Um, so I'm okay. I'm gonna try to make as many Nerf Gun reviews as I can, but because my birthday is in January, um, I'm going to have to do even more because uh, some of my friends are going to give me some stuff. And I'm not just doing guns either. I'm like, I can do equipment, just post in the comments down there. And, uh, yeah. Just, if you want to do, like, a vest, a site, uh, that would be kind of fun. Um, just post in the comments what you want me to do. Uh, if I don't have it, I'm sorry, but, um, I'll try to. I don't, I'll just mention some of the guns I don't have. I don't have, like, the Vortex. I don't have any of the Vortex ones. So if you're just thinking about that, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. I might get one for my birthday, so, uh, you might be in luck. Um, I don't have, uh, hmm. It's really not a lot that I do. I don't have the Hailfire, the new Hailfire. Sorry, I'm really sorry. Um, I don't have the Rampage, the new Elite, those two Elite guns. Uh, yeah. Um, but I'm pretty sure I got a new Nerf gun for my Christmas because my brother. Okay, so um, <laughs> you probably didn't hear that, but good. So, uh, on to the review. This is my favorite gun. It is the Retaliator, as it says right there. Retaliator. Okay, Retaliator. So, um, yeah. Uh, so, it's, it's actually a pretty good gun. Um, I thought, like, oh, the Retaliator, it looks like a Pack-a-Punched version. You know, if you don't know what Pack-a-Punch is, it's from Call of Duty. And um, when you upgrade a gun in the Pack-a-Punch machine, uh, it upgrades into something. And this looks sort of what if the um, recon would look like if it was Pack-a-Punched. So, uh, see, larger mag, ramp, and stuff like that. But um, it's actually a really, 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 really good gun. If you're not into small stocks and stuff, it's pretty small. So, um, yeah, it's, it's kind of... I really love it because just... Just the, the, the range. It's just so far. I could like aim out my window right now and they'd go like all the way to Safeway. And yes, I can see Safeway from my house. It's pretty small, but it's Safeway. <laughs> okay, um, so yeah, Taliator. It's a pretty good gun. Um, let's see. What else about it? Oh, yeah, okay, so, um, uh, huh, huh. this is kind of a crappy review because it's my first, but, yeah, don't judge me. <laughs> so, um, it's, it's a really good gun. It's a uh, pump back, of course. If, if a person actually made a Nerf gun that would actually, like, this size and would actually go auto fire, I'd be like, oh my god, really? This, this is, this crap is amazing, right? Because, like, most, most, like, well, not really, but most Nerf guns, right? They're like, 
really, 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 you have to pump them back so hard. But then the giant ones, like the Vulcan and the Stampede, which I do have, um, they always, they're just like, always auto fire because they're giant. Why don't you just make a small one? Maybe because like, the mechanics you need to put into it? Yeah, that would be amazing if they actually did that. And then um, they could also just, just imagine a gun like this with an awesome like red dot sight and then like it had I don't know what that was but it had machine gun you know that would be awesome it would be like an M16 with a, a, a sight and all you people are like well M16 have three bullet shots no they actually do yes but not all of them do. It, it's you can actually switch it. And like just play some Black Ops campaign. <laughs> play some play some Black Ops 2 campaign if they do have the M60. I don't know. I don't have it. Um, all, I, all I know is I do have Black Ops. So this one brother freaking smashed it. The last one I made, I deleted it because it sucked. <laughs> uh, this one probably sucks as much because I'm talking so much. Um, so. With the gun, it's really good, far range, but one of the downside is that it jams. You pull it back, right? Keep waiting. It will jam. Soon or later. Maybe because I modded mine. Probably why it doesn't jam, but it does jam sometimes. Um, and if you do get it to jam, right, like it'll go like you pull it back and it'll go, it'll go forward, right? Don't keep like, do, do, because that'll just break your gun. All you need to do is pull it back as far as you can and then pull forward, okay? And if it does um, jam sometimes, right, all you need to do, like if it does, it's not working, like this thing doesn't get pulled back. Or like, and you see something right in there, or it won't pull front no matter what you do. Even if you try to pull you back and then pull it front, just um, all you need to do is you need to pull the trigger. That's the good thing. And then the trigger will stay like this for a bit, and then you just press it, and then it'll come out. That's what happened with mine. I'm not guaranteed that it'll work with yours if you do have one and it gets jammed like that. But that's how mine. That's how mine did it. So, um, yeah, it's a pretty good gun. Um, uh, it holds 12 bullets in the mag. It says right there in the elite thing. Holds 12 bullets, and um, it's pretty big. It's the perfect size. The six one, the six, um, the first mag that was ever made. The one that had six bullets, too small. The one that had 18 bullet, bullets, way too big. It was like down to here. And, and then six bullets was like right here, so it was like, okay, this sucks, right? Because I was trying to make it like an M41, but then, then this may came. <laughs> and I was just like, woohoo, holla. Okay, what? <laughs> okay, so I'm going to review each part of the gun first. I'm going to, um, I'm going to review the actual blaster itself. Um, I've already shown you the mag. It's clear. I'll show you the mag first. It's clear. Uh, it says 12, it looks like a boss, um, it's perfect size, so I gotta say about the mag, it, it's actually bigger than it would look in the camera, so, <laughs> if it looks small in the camera, it's not that small actually, so the pistol, here's the pistol, see, how, uh, I will do a test fire in the second video, but when you shoot it, it, it goes pretty far, right? You take this part off, you shoot it in a really, really far place, right? Hey, where'd it go? It's like, it goes so fast that you don't even see it flying through the air. Like, I challenge you to get this gun and then try to see it go through the air. Like, and then it'll go like, like as fast as... The Roadrunner, if you know what that is. If you don't, too bad. Sucker! Okay, um, what was that? 
I really don't know. Um, yeah, Blaster, it's pretty good. Pretty easy. You can just do that. It has 12, so it's even better capacity. It has a little, little, little hole that you can keep an extra bullet in. And you can put your friends because it has a little extra hole. And then, ugh. So, it's a blaster. Easy to pull back. Sometimes jams. Uh, yeah. Um, I don't know if there's anything else in the blaster that I don't know. But leave in the comments if there is. Oh, yes. It has one tactical. Over there. <laughs> okay, next part of the gun. I'm going to do the biggest to smallest. So, the, uh, what the it's called? Let me sit down. The, um, this thing right here. Don't know what it's called. Maybe the barrel. The barrel. The barrel. I was thinking of putting, like, an extra barrel in there so it looked, like, way more actual machine gun-ish. But I can't, like, like this. Like this. Putting something like that so it would look, like, extra machine gun-ish. But I can't because I can't find anything that would let a bullet go through it. But... Actually, you can actually put it in there. With the bolt for it. So, um, yeah, um, it's a pretty good, it's a pretty good barrel. Um, looks exactly like the well, it's the exact same um build as the um oh my god re recon barrel. It's the exact same build, the exact same back and everything, exact same middle, except instead of line going. Except instead, instead of the lines going uh, front, if you look down the barrel, the lines are actually swirly. If you can actually see that. The one, lines are actually swirly, so I um, wonder what that looks like. Um, ooh. Ooh. Horge. Okay. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Uh, it's, it's a really good barrel. Um, it has two tactical rails, one on the bottom, one on the top. It's, it looks way better than the recon barrel, but uh, I just love this gun, you know. Okay, next, the stock. The stock is way, 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 way different than the um, uh, recon stock. I always thought the recon stock was so, like, flexible. It would go like, I could never get it straight shot, right? But this game, this is so solid. Like... Look, I'm pushing it up. Surprise, I didn't break it right there. It's so solid. Like, look, it. Look how thick it is. Just look at, look how thick that is. Look, look at this too. Look how thick that is. And it, it has these too, which you can also attach um a string onto. So if you're just wondering, yeah. Uh, it's it's just so, so thick. I should have edited. That's what she said there, but I don't know how to edit yet. Too bad. <laughs> I will do some Nerf War videos as soon as I get some friends and stuff to come over to my house. But, um, you know, I need a little bit of time. Uh, so, thank you for watching my videos, though. Uh, I really appreciate it. Subscribe if you want. Why am I saying this now? It's not even the end of my video. <laughs> okay, um, sock. It has a little grid thing there. Don't know really what's that for. It shows you it has that little like ah, blah, 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 blah. it has that so um uh you probably